Today, we will be honoring Dr. Antonia Pantoja, an educator who spent her life fighting for the civil rights of Latinos in the U.S. Take a look. As a native of Puerto Rico, Dr. Antonia Pantoja migrated to New York City in 1944. But despite being an American citizen, it didn't protect her from racist attacks that plagued so many Puerto Ricans who lacked access to health care, employment, and education. So Dr. Pantoja joined forces with other political activists to address those inequities head on. While earning a master's degree in social work at Columbia University, Dr. Pantoja discovered that due to discrimination and the language barrier in schools, the dropout rate for Puerto Rican youth was extremely high. So she founded ASPIRA, a nonprofit organization which empowers young Puerto Ricans by promoting positive self-image, commitment to education, and cultural awareness. In 1972, Dr. Pantoja scored a landmark legal victory with ASPIRA and the Puerto Rican Legal Defense Fund when they sued the New York City Board of Education for refusing to offer options to students struggling with the language barrier. Their suit claimed this denied them an equal education, and the court agreed, ruling that schools in New York and across the country are required to provide a bilingual education. Dr. Pantoja made history again in 1996 as the first Puerto Rican woman honored with the Presidential Medal of Freedom. And today, her legacy lives on in the communities she empowered and the minds she helped educate.